So Pedro's second question is, why is it evil? Why is it evil? Why is fiction evil? My reply is, fiction itself isn't necessarily evil. However, it tempts the creation of evil ex nihilo. It provides the illusion of a safe space for the author's imagination, where they may be free to dream up anything. Narrative fiction introduces structure to this realm that requires the character development of a protagonist or hero and an antagonist or villain. In narrative or novel fiction, conflict is necessary to drive the plot, and therefore any form of lasting peace is impossible. Insofar as peace is good, the structure of novels requiring conflict is, therefore, evil. Evil, in fiction, is considered harmless by libertines, but the truth is that well-developed villains are often more interesting to readers than their flatter, heroic counterparts. There can certainly be no denying that dystopias, written as terrifying warnings, are even right now inspiring a certain percentage of their readers to bring such visions about. 